What up, man? It's your boy Freddie Gibbs, man. And I'm fucking with hip hop at lunch. How's that? This is Mike Boyd, hip hop at lunch here with Freddie Gibbs. How's it going, man? Yeah, I'm going good, man. Chill, man. I'm gonna go smoke in a minute. Take a smoke break. You already know. <laughs> Hell yeah, in the studio recording for Cold Day in Hell. Yeah, definitely putting the finishing touches on the Cold Day in Hell. You know, about to come with some surprises for the people. It's gonna be, it's gonna be real dope. It's gonna be a dope experience. You know, I'm, um, like I said, like I tell everybody, man, I'm you know, blessed to be here, blessed to be doing what I'm doing. I like my job. It's cool. Hell yeah, man! You got some nice production on this. You got some good that, features. Heard that track with Two Chains. Mm. Definitely a standout track. Yeah, shout out to Two Chains, DJ Technique. Uh, looking out for your boy, man. I appreciate y'all on that. That was real dope of y'all to do that for your niggas. So, you know, it's gonna be dope, man. I told it's gonna be some surprises on this. It's gonna be some dope shit on there. Yeah, and right after I saw the trailer, man, I really couldn't wait to hear that track with Alley Boy and Big Crit. And then it came uh, out, and yeah. everyone's buzzing about it. I want to know like how it all came together, man. Um, you know that that you know that was a record that I you know I felt like you know only me and Alley could get on. You know, because I felt like we was on that same vibe, so it was just perfect, you know what I mean, um, vibe, you know what I mean, for that record, you know, Crit threw it to me, he said, you know, this would be good for you, um, you know, and I told, like, a story in the first verse, and I was like, all right, I need somebody else to put their input on the subject, you know, shit, who else but Ali, you know what I mean, so, you know, shouts out to everybody over there, duct taping that thing, you know, it, it came out dope, and, you know, that record kind of, like, set the tone for, um, you know, what I got coming on this, uh, uh, CDA shit, you know. Definitely. Now, that's a good tone. And then I saw you with the MTV down there rapping the verse, but I know you guys are shooting the official video. Yeah, definitely. We about to shoot a video, man. You know what I mean? We about to get it in. We about to go down to, the, to A-Town and do that. It's going to be real big. Yeah, and then speaking about duct tape, I heard you're going to be on Greenlight. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to that nigga Trouble Trouble. They busting for Trouble Trouble. <laughs> and what's it like working with Trouble, man? Oh, he could be a good nigga. We about to lay the record down, man. You know, like I said, I lead them all my niggas. Some niggas good niggas. Definitely. So uh, I saw the video for Do It For You and Rough. Right. Both came out clean, and then the reel is back to you. You got like four tracks on there hey, with man, Jeezy, 10, man. 103, man. Coming soon, man. That's all I got to say about <laughs> the CTE world, man. I mean, you know, it, you know, it ain't really no, no, you can't really label what we're doing right now with that, man. We just, you know, uh, putting together, you know, good, good music, and, you know, we just following Jeezy lead, and I think we all, you know, growing in our own right, so. It's cool, man. I wanted to know, like, all these collaborations that you're releasing with Jeezy, like, has there been one that stood out for you? Like, you got something off your chest, or you one that you really uh, felt good putting out yeah. there, man? Yeah. It's it's, it's one that y'all ain't heard. <laughs> 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 I got a lot off of, uh, you know, but, uh, you know, that's coming soon. You know what I mean? On future projects, you know, you're going to hear that. But, uh, you know, um, people love the rough record. You know, that's, uh, that's doing pretty good. Um you know, a, a lot of the shit we do is, is is coming together. It's meshing well. You know what I mean? And um, you know, I'm just like I said, I'm I feed off you know his energy when I'm in there in the lab with him, and um, we just go. So you know, just uh, the hard work starting to pay off. Yeah, man. Right around the time when you joined Jeezy, he was bringing in a little Lodi. I want to know like right, right. you working with Lodi. Yeah, Lodi um, Studio, man. Yeah, Lodi, Lodi helped me uh, get my, you know, foot in the door, you know, with, uh, you know, tracks he laid down. He's the first guy that I worked with, you know, when I walked through the door at, uh, at CTE, and, you know, and uh, both of us was new to the camp, so, but, you know, it, like I said, it meshed, it meshed well, man. Um, um, I was versatile enough to, you know, um, um, you know, jump on his tracks and, and do what I do, and, and, and Lodi versatile enough to, you know, um, you know, diff do different type of shit, I mean, like, he did uh, balling, and he did you know shake life. I mean, they're like two different records. So I mean, right. you know, Lodi uh, definitely um, you know he a real talented dude. You know what I mean? He definitely wanted to uh, you know next motherfuckers up in the production game, killing that shit, man. And, you know, his music got that young energy to it, man. So you know, motherfuckers gonna fuck with. It. 